Do is not just another task manager, it's really an advanced timer application with rich notifications. What makes Do so different is the philosophy that every task has a set completion time. My brain doesn't always work that way, so this app acts as a timer for me when I need something done at a specific time. To create a task, hit the plus button and fill in the description. There are preset due dates built in that help set a quick due time for the task you are creating. These preset times can also be changed in the settings to match times that work better with how you work. If you want something more specific, you can hit the red bar and specify a date and time. Another handy way to add tasks to do is to simply pull down. Then using natural language input, you can add a new task. I use this a lot for adding a quick task that doesn't need a lot of detail. Since do is about getting a task done at a specific time, if for some reason you can't get a task accomplished on time, in the notification you can set a snooze time. Snoozing will make the alert come back at the set interval. When creating a task, you can set the default snooze time for that task, so the task will auto-snooze if you don't interact with it when it is due. With the release of iOS 10, Apple set a limit on repeat notifications. Now in the settings, you can pick up to 10 times for the alert to auto-repeat. It's not a deal breaker for me, but I wish Apple wouldn't have made this change. When creating a task, you also have the option to repeat. I use this a lot for daily reminders like doing the dishes, checking the mail, take out the trash, and so on. If you want to use this as your only task manager, this is a handy way to set up bills that need to be paid on a set schedule. Dropbox Sync is built in. This way you can sync across multiple devices, whether you're using an iPad or the Mac app. It's also great for just using it as a backup, just in case something happens to your phone. Either way, it's smart to turn this on. Do a pull reminders from the iOS Reminders app if you're using that right now. A nice trick with that is if you turn this on, you can have Siri add tasks to the default Reminders app, and then Do will pull it over. You can have Do auto-sync them, or you can go and manually copy them over from the Settings menu. One of the biggest use cases for Do for me is I use the app Launcher to set up timers that I use a lot but aren't reoccurring. I launch them using the Launcher widget in Today View. The trick is knowing the URL scheme, and I will add a template to the description below. Do is a very useful app and can be found on the iOS App Store for $4.99 and is available for iPhone, iPad, and Apple Watch. There is also a Mac app available on the Mac App Store for $9.99. You can find me on the internet at ChristopherLolly.com and Twitter at Chris underscore Lolly. I'd really appreciate any feedback, and if you like what I'm doing, please subscribe and like the videos. Thank you.